I've seen this type of video done before by Velvet Mochi with red velvet twice in black pink, so I decided that I'd try this trend out with CLC. So just remember this is all for fun and isn't really meant to be taken super seriously. Obviously, I don't want CLC to disband or anything while they're gonna stay together, all that jazz. So yeah, got that out of the way, here we go. So the group that I would debut Seungyeon in is Dreamcatcher. I feel like she'd match the vibe that they put off and I would love to see Seungyeon in some sort of like scare crush concept. Like, oh my god, imagine that. Dude, it's so hot. <laughs> okay. But I also think that they have super intricate dances and Seungyeon of course would be really outstanding with that. Another thing that I think would be an added bonus is that she matches the personalities of the girls of Dreamcatcher. Like I don't know too much about them, but I know that they're so funny and so is Sonyeon, so you know, match made in heaven. So yeah, it would really be perfect. So the positions that I would give her would be lead dancer and sub vocalist because I feel like with that way she could definitely focus on their dances a lot better. <laughs> So I would debut Sunghee NG Idol for an array of reasons. One is that I think her vocals would mix so well with the other members. Like, can you imagine her and Minnie harmonizing together? Oh my god, heavenly. So yeah, Cube, we need that to happen right now. <laughs> but I also feel like she matches their concepts super well. Sunghee fits this really sophisticated girl crush vibe that they do, especially with the Senorita era. Like, oh my god, the things I would do to see Miss Sunghee singing Senorita. <gasps> Oh, okay. Okay, anyways, before I get off track again and going into songs that I really want to hear Sunghee cover, which could be like a whole nother video, the positions that I would give Sunghee are main vocalist with Mion and Minnie. And I think the three of them would honestly make such a great trio. Yeah, okay, now that I'm thinking about it, I think Cube needs to give us a mini Mion, Sunghee, and Soren unit, like a little G Idol CLC sub unit. Like, God, the power that would hold. Okay. <clears throat> okay all right so i'm sorry i keep going off track but yeah i'd also give sunghee a visual role because like <sighs> sunghee hot I feel like Yujin's whole vibe would fit so well with Wiki Miki. They have a teen crush sound to them, which is like girl crush mixed with cute, and Yujin was honestly made for that. Even if she isn't a teen, I still think that she fits well with it. I mean, Suyeon isn't a teen, and she still fits with it, so Yujin will be perfect. But I also think that Yujin would fit really well with the girls' personalities. Like, oh my gosh, especially Say. They both radiate giant baby energy, and I just want them to meet now. All right, okay, so this video has just, like, turned into me wanting CLC to interact with other groups. Whoops. But, yeah, on to positions. Okay, so I feel like Yujin could be a main dancer with Lua and Yujung. But, okay, also an FYI, Wiki Miki doesn't have official positions other than Suyeon being main vocalist and leader and Doyeon being visual in the center. So this is kind of just going off people assume their positions are. So what a lot of people think is that Lua and Yujung are main dancers. So I feel like Yujin could also kind of fit in with that. She fits their style of dance really well as well, and I could already imagine a little dance line cover dance, but yeah, okay, I need to stop imagining this shit, because it's just gonna make me sad, <laughs> but yeah, I would also just make her a vocalist, not really like sub or lead or anything, just a good vocalist, so she can focus a lot on her dancing and her vocals. <laughs> Soren would be so amazing in Luna. She fits their whole girl crush and cute vibes that they've had. And I think her personality would also fit super well with the other members. I think we all know that everybody in Luna is kind of a low-key crackhead. And so is Soren. So we know she would fit so amazing with them. <laughs> So Luna also does a lot of videos on YouTube. Y'all know the daily Luna vlogs that they post. And we all know that Soren also thrives on YouTube. And it would be so fun seeing her make like a whole new YouTube channel with the other Luna girls. Oh my gosh, that would be amazing. <laughs> and unit wise, I think that Soren would have been a great addition to Odd Eye Circle. And she can fit really well with their girl crush. And the vocals would match with Kim Lips and Cherry's so great. Oh my gosh. Soren would also like 
Sworn with a solo song, I mean, would be legendary. Oh my gosh, I want a Sworn solo song now. Okay, I need to stop like talking about this stuff because I'm just gonna want it even more. Q, please watch this video and give me all the stuff I want. <laughs> okay, but yeah, so for Sworn's positions in Luna, I think that I would probably give her a main vocalist position, like with Hasul and Chu. I think she would fit really well right there. <laughs> I feel like Yeun's whole presence fits Everglow's to a T. I know Everglow are fairly new and we don't really know where the group's going concept wise just yet, but with the first two releases, I think it's safe to say that they are going Girl Crush and Yeun is amazing with a Girl Crush. I think Yeun would also just fit in super well with the other girls. And like I said, I don't really know too much about Everglow. I know that they're all super sweet and like they all seem like they'd be badass, but like they're really sweet and cute when they're not on stage. And that's really like Yeun so much. Oh my gosh. But okay. Everglow right now doesn't have very many rap verses. I mean, I know in audios they added quite a few more. Like Aisha really fucking snapped, but I think Yeun would just add so much more to the group. And their B-sides are very R&B feeling. They have very rich vocals. And Yeun's singing voice fits that so well. And for positions, I would put Yeun as lead rapper, obviously. And I would also add her as sub-vocalist, as I actually think she would fit really well as a vocalist. I know we all talk about how great of a rapper Yeun is, but oh my god, she has such a great singing voice. And I think she would do so great singing in Everglow. God, LG would fit in so well with Cosmic Girls. Now I know I don't know too much about them, but I do know that their concepts were basically made for Elky. <laughs> they have very mature, fairy-like concepts when they do more girl crush vibes. And when they do cuter concepts, they're very mature, in my opinion. Boogie Up would also have been really good for Elky. Oh my gosh. And... All I know from WJSN is that they're all super sweet girls and LQ would get along with them so well. For positions, I would probably put her as main vocalist and main dancer. I think that, as we all know, she's an amazing main vocalist. I think she's a very underrated dancer. We don't talk about her as much as we should, but I think that LQ would definitely thrive under all of their great and amazing choreographies. Because that's one thing I do know about Cosmic Girls is that their choreographies fucking slap. Okay, also, I would say that Elkie could easily be one of their visuals in the group, because, like, Elkie hot. I gotta admit it, I love Unbin and cute concepts. I know she does great at Girl Crush, but in my opinion, she's just a little bit better with cute. So that's why I think she would be really great in Momoland. Her basically a cute group with a little splash of Girl Crush in there, which... That's even been for you. Beautiful, amazing. <laughs> she also has a 4D personality, as does Cheshire's all know. And so does pretty much every single member of Momoland. And she would just mix with their personalities great. She would also mix really well with them vocally, as it would just add a little more vocal color to their to their tracks. I just think having her little soft tone in there, chef's kiss once again. <laughs> Momoland also have very simple dances, and she would just flourish with those, like... I'm so hot, boom, boom, just great. She would be amazing with those. So for her positions, I would put her as sub-vocalist, sub-rapper, and visual. I think her and Daisy would be an amazing rap combo. And even adding Jewy in there, I think they would be an amazing rap trio. I love that idea. Beautiful, amazing, talented, show-stopping, never been done before, totally unique, all that jazz. I love it. I love Unbin so much. That's the moral of the story. Thank you guys so much for watching and thank you to Velvet Mochi for this amazing idea. I really hope more people do these. These are so much fun to watch and I had a lot of fun making it. So like and subscribe if you enjoyed it and comment which groups you would put the members of CLCN.